Right, in this video, um, we're going to take a look at uh, two little neat things that allow you to, to do some operations on vectors very quickly. Later on, we're going to see how to actually use flow control to really mine into to vectors and data frames as in wish with a lot of control. But um, here we're going to just take a quick look at how to uh, how to do things easily, and in, in particular to, to build a cumulative sum of a of a vector, and also to, to get a, a cumulative, uh, well, sorry, a, a pairwise difference of elements. So we're going to do this with the birthday money um, dot CSV data set there. So uh, some kid's birth, the money he's gone from his first to his sixth birthday, and um, we're going to start out by simply. Uh, importing that, so we're going to create a data set, birthday money, and that's going to be read.csv, and now I just point towards it, so it's on my desktop, and it's called birthday money.csv, we run that, that should all be there, let's just take a quick look, birthday money, yep, that's there, all right, so um, let's first get a running total. So, how much money has this this little six-year-old made um, in total? So, birthday money total, and we just use the function cumulative sum um, of that particular vector. So, birthday money, oops, dollar amount. And now, if we take a look at that we've got a running total. So that's actually really nice. It's a really easy way to 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 get exactly how much money you've you've got, so to speak. Um, and now what we're gonna do is also get the uh, the difference between every year um, to to see exactly how much we've got. And so we'll we'll just call this diff and um, yearly diff yearly diff and the function is very nice it's just um, well it's diff but if we were to to use diff we would have a problem and we'll explain that now so in other words we're saying uh, take the, the the difference and add an na to the first entry so let's see what what that does So that's only because it's taking the pairwise differences. So that, that 50 is actually the first element of the vector diff, birthday money, dollar amount. Um, and then minus 30 is the second, because indeed um, 50 is, is 150 minus 100. But if I didn't include an NA, then I would have um, a column here that would only have uh, five entries. And I need six for it to be a valid data frame. So I've just added the NA to, to the first one. So that's a. Uh, Two nice little functions um, for doing things relatively quickly in R.